these may be two of the most remarkable metals I've ever come across in my life in terms of toning and spectacular artwork. They're very old. They're from 1893, okay? And they're in their original cases, both of them flawless cases, which enabled them to develop these phenomenal natural toning. The one to the right is a silver metal, the one to the left is bronze, but it's probably a silvered bronze to get these phenomenal rainbow epic blistering colors. Um, it was issued by Cope and Nickel School of Painting in 1893. The artist was Frank Boucher. They're 57 millimeters. And it's the patina that knocks me out. I've never come across anything like it. The, the closer you get, the more, and you get different angles on it and, and different colors will come out like neon, blistering yellows and golds and bronze and terracottas. And then there's like blues and grays and purples and even kind of jade greens here and there. It's a sight to behold. And here's the silver version. It, it is predominantly in the cool tones. You have the hot tones and then the cool blues and greens and purples and lavenders. And it's just phenomenal. The artwork is so exquisite. Look at this angel with the light radiating from her head. And because it was a school of painting, look at the wings, how they kind of protect and shelter the artist as she holds a laurel over his head, symbolic of the school protecting these young artists, enabling them to tap into their fullest potential and cultivate their gifts. So the artwork, the symbology, the rarity of the coin, and the toning, I mean, whoa. I'm a toning freak. These, the, I've looked at hundreds of thousands of medals. I've never come across anything like this pair. To have two of them like this is, you know, just a sheer joy for me. Try to, when you, if you're into collecting, look for something unusual, something that's exquisite eye candy, something that's historically relevant, something that is symbolically informative, something that, you know, has history to it. You'd be surprised what toned coins and metals get at auctions. I've never sold anything, but I just enjoy f finding rare objects like this and then sharing them with you. I hope that you appreciate them uh, to some degree as I do. All right. Keep exploring.